the, my PSA showed that I was high, 5.6, and uh, <clears throat> they determined that nine out of 10 samples were cancerous. So after I got over that little shock, well, I began to decide exactly what I wanted to do. Did I want to do surgery or I want to go the, the, the route that I finally chose with, with uh, Lubbock Cancer Center? My son-in-law actually was the one that recommended it, and my internist both. My son-in-law is an internist, and, and they thought this was a place to go. They, they knew the outcomes and had known people that come here to have their, their work done, and they really knew of very few exceptions to success. So this is one they recommended, and the first one that I chose, and have not been unhappy with that choice. And I have always tried to, to do exercise that keeps my body in pretty good shape. And I ask, kept asking, when I, can I go back and start working out? And they said, well, you know, at, at, at three weeks, uh, we will allow you to try it. And so I haven't missed the time since. So it's worked out real well for me. Uh, my wife came with me, obviously, the first two times. Uh, and she was very concerned. And I would tell her after that, there's no you need you coming with me because I'm going to go do that and then I'm going to go work out. But what I liked about it was I was able after each one of those first two to go home and spend the night at the house. And, but they told me you could kind of do what you felt big enough to do and that's basically what I found out. I actually worked the next day after the first one because I had a fellow here from Minnesota that had, I restore old tractors and he was here to pick one up and I had to help him load it. So I did. I didn't tell them, but I did. <laughs>